Hi everyone, come to Remora TC to trade like a shark and not get eaten by one. Let's school together to protect and grow our money. This is a trade update of the GDX gold play. We've been following this ticker since uh, early November down here, these two candles here, and we've uh, had success uh, trading in and out uh, from this bottom uh, to where we are now. Uh, now, I can't claim that I have a 31% gain because I've gone in and out and um, not all of my trades went as planned. But uh, overall, this GDX ticker is continuing to do what uh, we are expecting. Let's review today's action and uh, consider where we might go next. If you remember last night in yesterday's video, I talked about putting stop, lo uh, stop losses at about uh, 27, uh, let me see, in the mid 27s, yeah? Or uh, along the uh, rising trend line here, okay? Just depends on how price moves. Now, because today's move was uh, substantial, 3.4%, uh, you know, yesterday's move was already 3.2. There's quite quite a lot of move, a big move here. This is almost 9% just here. Because we're up, up this far, we need to uh, consider if we're losing breath. Yes, front, there's a, a increase in volume, right? The past three days are just uh, green volume candles uh, with more volume. So that's a good thing. But at the same time, we have to see when we're going to hit resistance and uh, consider maybe taking some profit. So let's go to the one hour candle, one hour timetable, time frame, uh, so we can get a better view. So as you can see here, I've drawn this upper resistance trend line and this shorter frame. It's only a only two touches, so I'm not saying this is a trend line yet. Okay, not. I'm, I'm just saying maybe this is a trend line. I mean, if we go back, let's see if we can connect this down here. If we connect it down there, then maybe this is a better one. Okay, so this will be better. So my thought is this. We're up here. We hit resistance once up here. You can see it on the open. It opened. It gapped up, right? Nice gap up. And then hit resistance, sold back down, and then continued its upward move. And to me, this is a little bit of a, a rising wedge pattern. So uh, I feel it's a bearish pattern uh, just right here on this on the hourly. But let's see what the momentum indicators say. Uh, to give us a better view. All right, so what I'm looking at from an hourly standpoint are the peaks of, let's see, I'm looking at this candle and this candle, okay? Can you see those dots? All right, I'm looking at those two candles. You can see that the, the top of the green one, or the first one, is uh, higher than the second one. So it's downwardly sloping. Okay. So lower highs. This is a high. This is a lower high. So let's see what the momentum indicator is also indicating. It's also da uh, downward sloping. So to me, they're in agreement. What that means is it's, you know, it's not diverging. It's, there's no signal that says there's a change in momentum. So because they're both headed in the same direction, I can see perhaps tomorrow price may retest this upper trend line. It may even wick through it. So I'm just going to draw it here just to um, give us a, a better feel of what may happen. So on the hourly, I think tomorrow uh, price will go up and it will it'll fail again. So it'll, it'll go up, over, come back down. 
and stay underneath it. We'll have to see if the high up here, okay, if the high up there, which is which shows that from from this candle to this candle, it's upwardly sloping. If the high up here has a lower momentum candle, okay, momentum momentum peak, so it might be down here. Okay, in which case the momentum uh, would be diverging. Okay, so we'll talk about it tomorrow. I think I'm covering a lot of concepts here. The main thing is I, my premise is uh, it looks like we're going to continue to move upward tomorrow. Uh, if it fails here uh, very harshly, like it gets rejected really hard, then it's possible we'll, over the next few days, um, maybe... Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, price will consolidate in a sideways action until it hits this this trend line, and then we'll have to see how it reacts. Um, all right, so that's how I'm going to play this ticker. Uh, I hope you learned something from this video, and if you did, fantastic. Please like and subscribe. Click the bell icon so you receive notifications of when I post more content, and uh, share my, my channel. Good luck with your trading.